Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Erin and today we're going to be continuing Spider-Man Miles Morales. So before I hop into it, you may have noticed my background is completely different. This is all thanks to my mom. She had this really cool idea. These are like floorboards. I probably shouldn't ruin the illusion, but it's like wooden floor panels that she used for her dining room that she had left over. So she's like, what if we put it up on your wall and decorate it for Christmas? So she put this up one of the days I was at work while I was away and then I came home and it was all set up and I was just like, you're the best. She originally had Mr. Enderman. His name is... In case anyone doesn't know. He was originally here and his arms were like like this and he looked like he looked like a crucifix and I didn't really like it because I'm like that seems borderline offensive and also I just don't I don't want him there and also my head is in the way so I put him over here and he's just hanging out now but I'm sure I'll adjust him as time goes on on the other hand you may have noticed my hair is a little bit different it's sort of blonde now at the ends you can't really tell that much it's not that different my outfit I realized is not scream Christmas so maybe I should have planned this out better but I was in the mood for black black all around baby let's go so now that we have that out of the way I hope you like the background it's probably gonna stay for a little bit at least till the end of December and then I might decorate it a whole different way I might decorate it different as time goes on I'll probably change the lighting I'm not sure how I feel about all this it reminds me back when I first started making videos where the lighting was pretty bright I don't know how I feel about it I think I kind of like going back to it because before it was just a little too dark and sometimes the camera quality was kind of grainy because it was so dark in the room so I'm hoping this might make it a little bit better but anyway Let's get back into the recap of this game. So since Miles was trying to get closer to Finn, he told her that he was interested in joining the underground as an organization and she brought him over there and sort of introduced him to everybody and showed him around. People were sort of wary of him, understandably, because it was sort of a weird situation. So Miles disguised himself as Spider-Man again and searched further into the underground building and was trying to find where she was keeping the new form. Either way, he found out that she was keeping it at the theater. So when he went there, he found the new form and realized she is planning to destroy the Roxxon Plaza as a whole. Like, completely blow it up, which is insane. And I kind of brought up the point in the last episode where I don't feel like she's she means to hurt anybody, like the building will be uninhabited, but the aftermath of it, you know, there could be one casualty and it would be her fault and that's still one person that she's killed. And I don't think Miles wants that on his conscience either because if he's there to prevent it and he doesn't, then like I said, that's on him. It's the whole, with great power comes great responsibility. And also that quote from Tom Holland in um, Civil War, I think, where he said, when you have the ability to stop something and then you don't and then the bad things happen, that's because of you because you didn't do anything. It's not exactly what he said, but it's close. So I'm totally on board with Miles' idea where he's trying to stop her. I don't think what she's doing is necessarily for the good of everyone anymore. It's almost sort of become this revenge plot because she lost her brother to the company. And I understand she's trying to prevent them from going through with these reactors because the new form will make everyone sick in the city. So it's a good idea and she could totally team up with Spider-Man who she didn't know was Miles at the time. But since the underground is a bad group and they're terrorizing people and a very they're just a very reckless group and definitely outside of what Spider-Man wants in the city, he's going after them. And since Finn is running the underground, basically, she's obviously gonna be against Spider-Man. Does that make sense? So just when Miles was about to grab the new form, the underground showed up, we beat him up, and then the tinkerer showed up, Finn. We got into a whole chase scene. It was freaking crazy. It was crazy. There was a lot going on. But eventually Finn cornered Miles and broke like three of his ribs in a really brutal way. It was horrible. I felt so bad for him. <laughs> My boy. And in a last ditch effort to save himself, he revealed that he is Miles. And she didn't want to hurt him anymore, obviously, because they've been best friends forever. And if she went through still hurting him, I would have been like, what the hell are you doing? Thankfully, she sort of ran off at that moment when he was distracted and I imagine she's feeling very, very conflicted right now because Miles is her best friend, but Spider-Man is trying to stop what she's doing. And she's obviously very passionate about her quest here. Maybe in this episode we'll be able to do a little bit more side quests. I'm not sure how many will get done today, but I also really want to focus on the main story and get going with that because I'm just excited to see what's going to happen next. I say that every time, but I really am. It's just been such a cool game all around. I'm just having so, so much fun with it. It's just, 
really cool. I basically have little to no complaints about this game, and I'm sure if I do remember any complaints I have, I'll mention it when I finish the game, but other than that, I just love it to death. It's so much fun, and I'm really happy you guys seem to be enjoying the series too. So let's not waste more time, and let's get back into this game to see what happens next. Okay, you guys do not know the headache that I just went through to try to get everything set up. That was such a pain in the ass. For reference, my capture card wasn't working, my TV wouldn't even like register the HDMI cable, and my mic audio was recording the game audio for some reason, which was what was happening in the end of my um, Hellblade video. Just such a mess that I did not want to put up with today, and I literally got so angry, I almost gave myself a headache again. Just a mess. Let's hope the rest of this video goes a little bit better. But anyway, you might notice that we're not inside Miles' room. That's because last time I played this, when I ended the episode, I left his room to show my mom the Spider-Verse suit, so that's why I'm wearing it right now, because I wanted to show her. So I had to pause it real quick because Miles started talking. I was like, oh shit, I can't, I can't watch this yet. So that's why it looks kind of weird, and you might not remember it from the last part. I haven't pressed play yet because Miles just said, okay, I need to call Finn. So he's currently going to be calling Finn right now, so that's why I have to pause it or else he'll start talking. But okay, I think that's everything out of the way. Let's get into the episode for real. Let's actually play it because it's been too long for me and that was such a headache and I just want to have fun and relax. Okay. All right. Time to call Finn. Okay. Hope she answers. This is scary. Hi. Spider-Man. Finn. Hey. We need to talk in person. So you can lie to me again? So I can make this right. Please. Meet me at Trinity Church. No more lies, I promise. If you're screwing with me... <sighs> fine. I'll see you there. At least she's willing to meet. Okay, but... Okay. Trinity Church, let's go. That's not really fair to, of her to do. She... He isn't the only person keeping secrets, you know? She kind of lied about a lot of stuff. Or at least not lied, but was like, you know, keeping a whole lot of secrets. Weapons deal going down nearby. I love this suit. Thank you, anonymous app user. Okay. I think I'm gonna keep the suit on for a little bit while I fight some crime and then I'll go talk to Finn. <laughs> oh, I love this suit. <laughs> yes. Hello friends. This is the Danicast with our debate. Um Oh shit. I'll listen to that when I'm done with the fighting crime. How's that? He's I actually kind of like the slower frame rate. I don't know. <laughs> so cool. Oh no, don't get in that car. No, shit! No. I'm not supposed to let them do that. Okay. God, this is so cool. This is my favorite suit by far, I think. Come on. There we go. Good job, me, Miles. Okay. Uh, let that be a lesson! <laughs> Just don't do it again. Cool. Okay, that definitely reminded me of uh when Miles, you know, like makes his voice deeper. I look forward to working with you. <laughs> I love you. <laughs> okay. Anyway, let's watch or listen to the debate thingy. Where is it? Debate day with JJJ. Hello, friends. This is the Danicast with our debate. At that's your intro? Lame! We in the business call that burying the lead. Hype it up! Let me ask you something, Danny. Do you ever think about what you're inciting? About your journalistic integrity? More than some. Because your campaign against Roxxon is bad. 
baffling to an actual journalist like myself. You should be attacking the young, unproved vigilante who keeps causing problems in Harlem. What? You, you twist everything Spider-Man does into something malicious while simultaneously excusing everything Roxanne does wrong. All Spider-Man needs for you to support him is to get a better PR department. Uh-uh, uh-uh, uh-uh. The only problem Spider-Man fixes are the ones he causes. I won't praise the arsonist for putting out his fire. Meanwhile, Roxanne built a beautiful plaza in a failing neighborhood. By tearing down homes and businesses, our new Spider-Man is proving that Harlem isn't the failure Roxanne makes it out to be. And you, Mr. Jameson, for someone who claims to love New York, you sure do seem to hate New Yorkers. You are clearly emotional, young lady, so I'm invoking the mercy rule on this debate. Jared, shut it down! <laughs> and whose idea was it to debate a teenager? Yeah. There are no good objects to destroying a child! Get the car! I need a hot stone massage! Hello? Hello? Uh, yeah. Well, thanks for the debate that you demanded, Mr. Jameson. To everyone else, remember to stand up every half hour while working at a computer. Bye! <laughs> okay. Well, that was great. Um, and I definitely don't follow that rule, so that's not good. But, well, let us look at- I have three skill points here. So let's see. Press X when landing on a en on a enemy. On an enemy during Venom Dash to perform a free Venom Jump. Oh. Oh! That's really cool. Let's do that. Okay. Um, gunslinger hold triangle to yank and throw guns imbued with bioelectric power. Oh! That's pretty cool. Doing that. Um, venom stun enemies knocked into other enemies will transfer their venom stun. So let's wait on that and see. Oh, I definitely need this. Allows you to be invisible longer. Cool. And we have the gravity well thing. I guess I can upgrade it. Becomes strong enough to affect large enemies. Um, let's hold off on that just because I don't use that very much. What about the mine? Let's upgrade the mine. Because I, I like those ones. Okay, I love my suit. I don't know if I should take it off. I will when I go into a cutscene. Hold on, there's a time capsule thing. Whoa, that was cool. Finn loved coming here. <laughs> Said it was a good place to think. Where is it? Piece of cake. Got the tour Pegasus. Oscorp in eighth grade. Finn was way skeptical. Said that they were gonna destroy New York one day. Devil's breath almost proved her right. Yeah, seriously. I wonder where she was and all that. We didn't look at the social feed yet. Okay, well, sorry. <laughs> Let's read this real quick before we get into it. Uh, Roxanne said the plaza is still going to open on time. Somehow? I heard PDNY is offering a reward for any intel on the underground. Nice to know they're doing something. Did anyone else see Brooklyn Spider beatboxing at the docks? Um, yo, Brooklyn Spider, when's your album drop? <laughs> Honestly, I wouldn't put it past miles to do that wow he's up to 300,000 followers that's crazy be careful out there in new york the storm of the century is the real deal and it looks like it's about to hit us hard be sure to stock up on plenty of water candles and toilet paper okay bye oh there's gonna be a storm oh storm of the century new york races for gale force winds and an unprecedented cold front as winter storms draws near i did not know that i'm sure we'll get to see that omg look at this it's spider-man and tinker chasing each other omg just heard a loud explosion and came outside to check on things and somehow my car exploded i just paid it off last month Oh, poor guy. Does anyone know if insurance covers random supervillain explosion damage? Asking for a friend who borrowed their other friend's car. Is there a city out there that doesn't have supervillain activity on almost a daily basis? Asking for a friend. They use the asking for a friend twice in a row. Whoa, y'all see the videos of the new Spider-Man chasing the Tinkerer through the city? Kids got some moves, and the Tinkerer, those boots are insane. <laughs> I think the underground are kind of cool. Where do I sign up? Are you serious right now? Kinda, yeah. Did you see their weapons, lol? Wow. <laughs> yeah, I, that, that would definitely happen in real life, I have to say. All right, let's actually get back into the game. A friendly neighborhood Whee! user just posted about oh God. being held up. Okay, well, let's do that. I keep getting sidetracked. Side Help. God, this suit is so cool. 
I'm kind of digging the slow frame rate, honestly. Like, I wasn't really liking it at first, but the more I play around with it, it just feels right for when you wear it. Oh, I just totally missed a crime. I don't know why. I'm sure it's fine. Whee! <laughs> Does he do different moves when he's wearing this suit? It feels different. I don't know. It's so cool. Oh, I love this game. <laughs> yes. Honestly, who would ever fast travel in this game? Like, I... I think I've only fast traveled like twice in the other one. It's just like the main appeal of this game is just getting to be Spider Man and swing around. Just traverse the environment in one of the coolest ways possible. Okay, I'm gonna ignore the, the crimes for right now just because. You know, I, I really want to continue with the story. I, and I keep getting sidetracked. Whoa! How do you do that? Oh my god, free fall dive. Whoa! That's so cool! What? Torpedo dive? What? Windmill. <laughs> What the heck? Oh my god, I need to try these out. Hold on. Let's get to a tall building. Sorry. <laughs> I literally just said I didn't want to get sidetracked again. But here I am. Okay. Whoa! That's not really what I want to do, but... Okay, well let's get this real quick. <laughs> god, there's just so much stuff. Ugh. Miles, I'm getting a lot of reports of a helicopter out of control. Genki, now is not the time. Oh, wait, what? Whoa. Here we go. This is okay, cool. Wait, what? Oh shit, hey guys. Wait, just go up. Wait, where where are you going? Well, I just did, so. All right. I think my work here is done. How do I... Do I have to hold square to do that? I really want to do those tricks. What do they mean by being in trick mode? You just hold square? Oh, shit. <laughs> Either way. I'm sure I'll figure it out eventually. Okay. Well, let's change into my other suit. Freaking love this suit. But also, it's time to be... For real, Miles. Get back into that realism. Why does it still feel like he's in 10 frames per second? Hold on. Yeah, I still have this on. My bad. Okay, there we go. I was about to say, I'm like, he still feels like he's going slow. Alright. Hey, Finn. <laughs> Hope you don't hate me. She probably does. <laughs> that was a hell of a way to tell me you're Spider-Man. What if I'd killed you? You want me to feel bad because you almost killed me? I <laughs> want you to stop lying to me. I let you in the underground because I thought you understood. I do understand. What Krieger did to Rick? Roxxon needs to pay. Not like this. This is the only way I can beat him. 
I need you to look the other way. Please. I can't. I made a promise. So did I. Why'd you pick here? My dad brought us. To that concert. Seven choirs from seven countries. Remember? Ghana was my favorite. Ghana wasn't there. You're thinking of Guinea. <laughs> no, no. I'm pretty sure it was Ghana. Guinea, Belize, Poland, Cuba. South Korea, Thailand, Venezuela. You're right. <laughs> I usually am. Usually. But not right now. <laughs> what? Oh, hi. What? Is he wearing rocks on armor? Oh my god. Why are you here? Oh shit. Oh, that's right. Their stuff like doesn't work that. Oh uh, shit. I guess I was hoping that you and me would see eye to eye. Where are we? <sighs> You're behind the curtain, bud. <laughs> this is our most secure facility. In here, the sausage gets made. You're a real prick, you know that? Hmm. <laughs> you know, when her brother and I were developing new form... All you did was put your name on the patent. <laughs> He said the only thing you knew how to do was sell other people's ideas. You know, at least I still got a pulse, babe. But let's not dwell, right? The first thing we're gonna do is I'm going. <laughs> <laughs> that is awesome. Don't, don't. Are those involuntary defenses? Oh man, that's hot. I see, I'm gonna get that mask off you. And I'm gonna find out what makes you tick. Because you just smell like next level bioengineering. And you know what that smells like to me, kid? <laughs> that smells like money. This guy's pretty easy to okay. read. I'm gonna hit the gym. Leg day, can't skip it. Get her to tell us where my new form is. <laughs> Can't really open the plaza without it. Oh, oh and uh, use him. Time to finish what we started on the bridge. Oh, no, shit. No cameras now. Now look, huh? <laughs> Jeez. Let's find a way out of here. I'm still gonna be able to walk around. Roxon kept Rhino oh, instead God. of giving him to the police. It's crazy. Nothing yeah. about Roxon surprises me anymore. You okay? I will be. Once we're out. They I'm didn't even touch her. <laughs> Can you check that computer? Okay. 
Yeah, when back when uh, Roxanne showed up after we beat Rhino, they were like, oh, we'll let the police handle it, but they just kept him for what themselves. Did you find? Ugh. There's the exit through this office. We have to lift the base lockdown first from the control room. First, we need to escape the security wing. I'll go down to the floor, see what we're dealing with. All right, I'm gonna have to deal with Rhino soon. Even though I won't be able to use my Venom power, though. Door's locked. Venom worked in the cell. Should work on the door. I can find whatever's powering it. Hello. Okay. Here we go. It's <laughs> unlocked. I'm headed to the floor. Right above you. It's kind of funny to see like her smiling photo and this is all serious. <laughs> no, whoa! I didn't even notice this part. Okay. I I honestly just love Troy Baker, even though people are like he's such an overused video game actor, and he is, but he's still so good, man. That security door is our way out, but I'll have to hack a few terminals to disable the alarm. I'll handle the security guns. Oh boy. Security cameras are down in the south wing. Rhino probably turned them Shit. Two more ahead. Shouldn't have done that. How do we even find those two? Okay. Did Rhino track them? No, he's just a tool. Point and shoot. An outside agent gave us the um, location. Let's see. All clear in this sector. Let's bring him over here. Fire's up. Check it. Word of advice. Watch what you say around Krieger. He seems relaxed, but he's got a short fuse. Go through three different Wait, assistants clear. in less than a month. Ooh. This reminds me of that. Uh. I can do it. Don't really see the point of holding That part in the other game. Ready for another computer. Um. Where we were trying to help MJ sneak by the lights out for you, Finn. Demon guys. Blowing up the plaza was a bad idea. <laughs> oh god. Frick. <laughs> but there has to be a better way to deal with Roxxon. Sometimes strategies are imperfect. Like deciding to lie to your friends. Let's just focus on getting out. Just- right. is this real- Oh my god! <laughs> I didn't know you could come up here! <laughs> that freaked me out! Okay. Okay. How about you go over there too? Yeah, go over there buddy. Come on. There you go. Um How about What was that? Heads up! I got webs over here! Man, that's fun. That's a make stall. I guess my broken bones are fine. Oh, he does regenerate really fast, though, right? Okay. Is that no? That's not him, right? I need you to trigger the override back there. On it. Where? Oh. Gotcha. Okay. Uh, over here, I guess. Looks like some kind of record archive. Wonder what's on these computers. I don't know. Looks like a voice memo from Krieger. I liked Rick Mason, I did, but bleeding hearts don't survive this business. Maybe we should set up a plaque in his memory or uh, Oh, oh, uh, name a bench after him. Huh. Yeah, I bet he'd love that. Simon Krieger. Bastion of compassion. <laughs> he basically oh hi. Okay, really. Why Tinkerer? It's <laughs> a nickname from Rick. Oh, when he was teaching me to repair stuff in the shop, he'd call me the little tinkerer. I don't know. Makes me think of him. I never heard that story. I like it. That's cute. Gives it a more of a reason for her to be called that because it's kind of a goofy name, you know. You know, if we work together, we could do a lot of good for New York. See? Yeah. But only if we figured out how to trust each other. She needs to stop being so salty. You're not- I'm not the only one keeping secrets here, lady. I still can't believe you're cool working with the underground. And I still can't believe I actually thought you wanted to join them. Okay, you know what? I don't need your sass right now. I don't need your sass. 
So, I'm gonna head out and do my own thing. <laughs> you can do that? What? I did not think that anything would happen. That's insane. Wow. Okay, cool. Well. Hey. Roxxon's stealing your stuff. From what I hear, you, you are need. Too. Okay, you, you know what? I don't. I almost just freaking died, and you didn't really seem to care. So, let's stop being a little pissy at each other, okay? More info on Rhino. I know he says he wants out of that suit, but let's face it, the metal onesie is the only reason anyone gives a damn about him. Just upgrade his armor. If we help him smash Kid Spider, he'll forget all about wanting out. There's nobody this guy won't manipulate. <clears throat> Maybe we can use that against him. Maybe make Rhino hate Simon Krager somehow. Notes about Roxxon independent contractors. We need an outside partner to track Tinker and Spider-Man for us. Tombstone's off the grid. Black Cat's gone straight. Ish. <laughs> what about the guy in the purple? What did he go by? For? Prowler? Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he'll do. Guy in purple? That can't be. No. Oh, no, no. He's working for Simon Krager. That's who he's working for. In my head, I was wondering maybe he's working for Fisk, but I don't know. That sucks. <laughs> Wow. Yeah, that's definitely not gonna go well, is it? Uh. Triggering the override. There's a voice memo on here. Sir, the police are asking about Rhino. What do we tell them? Our man at the raft is setting up a special work release program. Tell the police Rhino's doing the little community service. I can't believe they got away with this. Yeah, how, how would anyone believe that? Can do. Alrighty then. Alrighty. Hello. I'm uncomfortable, sorry. Please don't get hurt again, my boy. I love you. I can't let them go until I have my new form. You shouldn't even be here. Your muscle was only supposed to grab the girl. Ah, uh, no, he's here. Yeah, he didn't like that. Here's the deal, bud. Spider-Man's the best leverage I got against Miss Mason. I mean... You caught them together. Well, I mean, you caught them, but it was thanks to your intel. So clearly there's something going on there. You agreed to leave the kid alone. Uncle Aaron? Ah, uh, the kid. You saw him. <laughs> I love how you say that. It's just so paternal. Let Spider-Man go. Uh... And I'll get you. Feed you underground intel. They're right there. See? Leverage. Works every time. My Spider-Man. <laughs> Here's leverage for you. I've seen things. New form making people sick. What you did to Rick Mason. If I went public. Yeah, but you won't. Here's the deal. You're a wanted thief. Plus all the jobs we've done together. But you'd be in the cell right next to mine. And we both know you're a little too self-serving for that. So, we're gonna head in and check on Miss Mason and Spider-Man, uh, but it's kind of an invite-only party. Yeah. Bye. <laughs> he plays the part of a douchebag really well. A little too well, I think. Roxxon, but I didn't think he'd... he sell me out. I can't believe this. You led me into a trap. Girl, shut up! I keep listening to you! Ben, no. There has to be an explanation. I didn't know this would happen. Just... save it. Let's keep moving. Can you get this open? Yeah, sure. 
She's kind of pissing me off. <laughs> I mean, I understand why she's upset, but I'm annoyed. They initiated a lockdown. That's the control room we have to get into. So we need passive security shutters. Got a maintenance panel here, but it needs power. Hmm, I wonder what I have to do. do. <laughs> there. You got power. Accessing. Uh, I can't hotwire the shutters, but I can move machinery, like that crane. Maybe we can use that. I'll look okay. around. Interesting. They build engines for their APCs in here. Hey, I can raise and lower that crane. Is yes, that useful? Yes, you told me. But what do I... <laughs> lower it to here? Oh, like that? Hey, crane's over this engine thing now. Oh, engine thing. Ah. I've got an idea. I'm uncomfortable. Can move the crane back to the assembly line? Yeah, I think I know where you're headed. Feels weird playing games in, like, a light room. Bright room? Can you say it? Okay. Oh. This laser should activate the engine. Oh crap! I missed it. Laser shorted out. I think I can reroute power. Oh, laser the shorted, low nodes. but it still works. Needs a new power source. Um, where's the thingy? Okay. Nice. Webs are conducting electricity. Okay, cool. But. How do I... Or to the laser. Oh, there's another one. Oh, here we go. Bam. Wait, what? There's a stupid thing in the way. Bro. <laughs> hey. What the freak? No, not the... <laughs> not those guys. Glasses in the way. How's that? Boom. You're good. Use the laser. One laser coming up. Oh, hey, look at that. Perfect. What are we trying to do? If overcharge the engine, it'll be explosive. Oh. And explosive is just okay. going to destroy those shutters. I understand. They're both some smart cookies. Get down! Yeah! Let's go. Almost out. Where's Rhino at, you know? That's our way out. Give me a few minutes to get it open. Looks like they guessed our plan. Not hard. There's only one exit. All right. Oh, I'll boy. take care of those guards. You get that door open. Ugh, one thing. Did you ever think about calling me to tell me you were Spider-Man? You know... After my parents died, Rick basically had to become my dad. I thought I'd miss having a brother, but I had you. Finn, I... Get the door open! That won't hold forever! Go! Man, just let them have a moment! I'll be fine, just go! Is she gonna die? Ah, shit. I know I was talking crap about her, but those guys with the lights <laughs> on their helmets can spot heat signatures. What? They'll see you if you try to go invisible. Wonder how much of their R and D department is dedicated to fighting us. Probably Accent millions of dollars in untaxed money. You clear the floor. I'll work on overriding security so we can get out. I can still access machinery if you need me to move anything. Okay. Is it only those guys with the lights? Let's do. Webs are holding the door. The okay. Whole base is on alert, though. It's showing who can see me. That's pretty cool. Uh. There's only one way out of the base. Can I? Gotta come through here. Can I yank you up? Tinker is tricky. Ugh. Ah! Nope. 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 They know you're here. They're calling me. Crap! Guess I'm doing this the loud way. That sucks. Ow! No, these guys suck. Okay. 
There you go. Ah! Ah, shit. I need to get out of here. I need to get out of here. No, that, I didn't. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm scared. I'm scared. Ow. Knock him out. Ooh. Ooh. Ah, shit. Oh, my web shooters are gone. Oh, let me grab the thing. Uh. Ah! Oh, my God, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. No, 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 no. I'm scared. These guys are tough. How am I? Shit. I'm dead. Cramp. <laughs> Let's try to do this smart this time. And not stupid. Let's take care of these guys first. Out for the count. Right. You good in there? Yeah. Those webs are holding the door. Whole base is on alert though, so be careful. Alright. There's only one way out of the thing. So... Gotta come here. I don't know. No, get back here, dude. No! No! Come here. There you go. Yoink! Now there's a dude I want to take out. I heard something. Check it out. Hey, buddy. See us the time. You and your stupid goggles. You suck. Oh. Okay. Um. Can I take care of you? <laughs> Did not think I would be able to grab him. She was always this easy. Ten four. I'll check it out. Okay, there's another guy over there that I need to take care of. Where are you? How did that guy not see him? Yeah, I'm not gonna complain. I'm not gonna say anything. Lights out for you. Come on, buddy. Please. Oh, look, look behind you. Stressful. I'm surprised no one is in there. Like, watching the whole thing. Gotta watch the sin. I know you don't trust me. You're right. I don't. But I get I it. To change that. Stop going behind my back and stop acting like I haven't thought this through. That's exactly what you. I take down the plaza. No one except Roxon. You know they deserve it. Just. I promise to talk it through with me, okay? I promise to listen. Really listen. I've made up my mind, Miles. You need to start accepting that. Then, I'm gonna have to stop you. You need to start accepting that. Good for you, Miles. I'm sorry, I I'm can't... Sorry. Meet me in the showroom on the far side of the assembly line. Is that everyone? See you there. No, it's not. But, like... She is such a hypocrite. <laughs> like, I like her, and I feel really bad for her, obviously, but, like, she keeps saying, you haven't thought this through, you keep going behind my back, you do all this, and you're lying to me, and it's like, she did the same thing. <laughs> I mean, she didn't, like, manipulate him like he did, but, dust. you know. I don't know. I don't know. I just I'm I'm biased for Miles, I guess. Oh, <laughs> goodbye, monitor. Where'd you go? Is 
that everyone? Coming? Looks like they locked the doors. I'll find another way. What if we went public yeah, about Rick's death? Do you have proof? Because I don't think the word of two vigilantes is gonna convince people. There's gotta be a way. Uh, is Rhino gonna come out? I, I bet, like, 50 bucks Rhino's gonna come out and I'm gonna have to fight him in here. This is just obviously the room for it. I think that's the exit. Hey. Lost and found. Thanks. I know this place. This is Krieger's lab. Krieger has a lab? Mostly for show, but yeah. Rick showed me a photo once. Krieger's lab. Wait. All the current new from project data is on here. Oh. Toxicity reports, failed safety reviews, and Krieger's names on everything. Take this would destroy way. Roxanne. But in a better way. Ooh. I called it. Like my new color. Yeah, that looks great. Your little zappy pops. Zappy pops. Come on, <laughs> finish this! Oh, God. <gasps> oh. Okay, that I didn't call. You handle Rhino, I'll take the guard. Okay, sure. Go for a ride. We need to break Destroy his that. Oh, I can't use it against it. Okay. Thank you. A good death. I think you. I'll keep knocking you down. I appreciate it, Rhino. There we go. Run into this. I am. That's sweet that she helped me out, though. Hey, bro. What about the supports? Ooh. Oh, shit. Okay. Oh, damn. Alright. Chill out. Bro. Hey. Come on. Ah! There we go. Wait, no. I'm trying to. I'm trying to get on your back again. There we go. Okay. <laughs> that works, I guess. Oof. Get him, Miles. Get him. Oof. Teamwork. Uh, <laughs> I see that. Maybe if I oh. the engine. Hey. Oh, shit. Ow. My body. Do it again. Ow. Engine his armor. Where? Where is it? Ah! I I ran into it. Son of a bitch. No. Here, let me throw it. Thank you. What do you think I'm trying to do? Oh. Yeah, we don't- no, we don't kill people, you're right. <laughs> I- I remember now, I'm Spider-Man, I don't- I'm not supposed to do that. Where'd the thing go? God, this is so hard. I had to avoid everything he does. There we go. Bam, bitch. Let me hit you, please. Ooh, I should not have tried to hit him. My bad. <laughs> Son of a bitch. 
bitch. He's so annoying. You're getting under my skin. I feel the same way. Am I winning? It doesn't feel like it. No, 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 not him. It's so hard because I'm, I'm like trying to aim at these guys, but he swings to Rhino and I get hit. him. <laughs> I'm just kicking his butt. Literally. said respect women. <laughs> Man, this fight's awesome though. was really hard. Holy Wait. crap. My camera's about Just to die. Make sure he doesn't do anything. I'll be right back. Alright. Oof. Krieger Sato shut Roxxon down. The right way. You know, Krieger told me how your brother died. <laughs> Very amusing. <Jeez. laughs> shut up. <laughs> he also told me it was your fault. <laughs> we can update the reactor. Try to supercharge it to make his deadline. If Finn goes through with her plan. Oh my god. Oh. Harlan. You watched him die. <laughs> Helpless. you. But 
poor family. My family's dead. Genki. I need help. Oh my god. No. <laughs> I'm gonna go grab a washcloth. Some antibiotics. Make sure you shut the door. Miles? Where oh are shit! You? Pero que pasó? Oh. What are you wearing? I have to tell you something. <laughs> Finn's attacking the I didn't plaza. know she'd find out. Yeah. So that was you chasing her through the city. The Spider-Man. You could have died. No lo puedo creer. Why didn't you tell me about any of this? All those talks we had? How to keep yourself safe? But this... I didn't want you to worry. And the other Spider-Man's gone. I just keep making things worse and worse. And I'll screw up things with you. Miles. There is nothing you could ever do or ever be that would make me stop loving you. Nada. You give me strength, Miles. That's all a hero really is. Someone who's brave for the people they love. Just a guy who doesn't give up. Gloria's handling feast, and Teo's gonna help us go door to door. Perfect. Let's get this evacuation started. I'll meet you outside. You remind me more of your father every day. Aww. You stay safe. Well, that made me kind of teary eyed. <laughs> that line she said kind of got me a little bit. Hey, I'm telling people in Harlem they need to evacuate before me and your mom go door to door. Okay, cool. I, I wanted to say thanks for always having my back, man. Hey, I could use your help before you go. You got it. I want to cross-reference underground activity with buildings that could store a new form. Maybe you could hack Oscorp surveillance towers, or... I'm in. It'll take a while to narrow down. That's all right. Thanks, man. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna stretch my legs a little, right? then head out. Aww. I like how his room is progressively becoming more and more, um... Like, represents him more and more as they... As they style their home differently that didn't make any sense but um that line made me a little a little teary-eyed because my mom said that to me one time the whole there's nothing you could ever do to make me stop loving you it's just it's such a mom thing to say that it kind of kind of hit my heart a little bit it's it does a good job at what being a mom is supposed to be like representing that just accepting your kid who they are. Your mom texted. She's working on this building, then heading down the block to evacuate people closer to the plaza first. You still gonna help? Totally. As soon as I find Finn's latest new form set up. What do you think I should say to Finn when I find her? I don't know, man. Get the new form from her. Then you can offer the olive branch. Yeah, hope it goes better this time. I don't ever really s You know, I don't see you ever really being able to... Whatever's about to go rebuild. down in Harlem? I hope our place survives they had, it. After Definitely all that. Definitely feeling like mom's space now. Aww. It's crazy how the house is changing every time you go through it. That's so cool. Hey, it's me. It's me. A little bit. Alright. A lot of strong people in my family. Time to live up to it. Feels like we're reaching the end of the game almost. I don't know. I didn't expect things to sort of ramp up so quick. 
I guess I forgot this is sort Looking of better than I did when I got home. Mm -mm. He does that every time with his hair. That's adorable. It's starting to snow. More and more. They got such a cute little house. Let's look through his room a little bit more. I'll make this right. For all of us. This isn't what her brother would have wanted, you know. But at the same time, I probably shouldn't say that because he wanted to destroy the reactor. But he didn't want to blow up the whole plaza. Gonna you know? take some time to work on music when this is all over. Mm -hmm. You think you have enough time to get people out of Harlem? Depends how long it takes Finn to finish making the new form explosive. You're right. I should get moving. <laughs> but I'm still gonna look around the house because I feel like it. Such a cute little house. They took down their Christmas tree! Already? No! We leave ours up till like January. Mid January. I'm not sure a pre hero wing snack is the best idea right now. There's, there's always time for a snack. For a little Rice crispy Popcorn? Hell yeah. Nice. Alright, I guess I should go. Alright. <laughs> That's such a cool animation. Look at him go. <sighs> okay. Got some time while Genki tracks down Finn. I should check the app. See if people need help. We got a lead. Talk to Haley. <gasps> yes, I want to do that. Okay. I, I I don't think I'm gonna continue with the main quest yet. I'm gonna go talk to Haley. Is she cute? <laughs> She's so cute. Genki says a street artist named Haley's got a lead on the people messing with Harlem. Okay. Health increase five. Whoa. I'm level 15. The heck? Um, skills and one skill point. Let's. I really like my camouflage. Stealth cocoon. What? Now that's really cool. Hold. L1 and R1 to yank down stealth cocooned enemies, causing them to impact the ground and web up nearby enemies. Probably gonna forget to use that, I always do, but that's really cool. I don't wanna switch up my suit just because I'm gonna be in a cutscene and I don't really want it to be super jarring. So let's go talk to Miss Haley. Hey girl. Hi. Hey. Are you Haley? Haley, everyone's calling you our Spider Man. My friend Scarlett even wanted a picture with you. Should I be reading this? <laughs> she can always request it in the app. Uh, Genki <laughs> said you could help me find the guys messing with Harlem? They're working out of a shipping center near the river. I followed them after they tried to mess with Kingpin King's Day Parade. <laughs> Huh, Kingpin? <laughs> followed them? It's dangerous. And brave. Uh, I'll, I'll go there. <laughs> Try to shut them down. Thanks for looking out. Try not to die. <laughs> she is so cute. That's so cute that they talk to each other like that. I didn't know whether to read it myself. I'm sorry. I, I don't I don't know. In case someone's hey just man, listening to the episode, told me where to find our criminal friends it. set up. Hoping I could shut down however they're communicating with their boss. I'll check nearby cell phone towers. Do some network surveillance. See if I can figure it out so we can cut the connection. Dope. Call you when I'm there. Maybe I shouldn't read it. I don't know, I'm conflicted. Maybe I'm taking away from like I don't know. <laughs> I'm conflicted now. Whee! Man, that was cool. Everything Genki. in this game is cool. Guys are definitely set up here. Gonna clear them out. See if I can shut down this whole operation. Happy punching, Spider-Man! Okay, this will definitely... be the most effective way to do it. You guys all need to go over there. Hurry up. Go walk. 
talk to the big guy today. We're supposed to hop. Guys, we got a man down. Oh, well. Cool. Here, take five. Hey, man. This will make stop. Wow, there's a lot of dudes here. Dang. Maybe I can make up for how bad I was. <laughs> the fighting was during that rhino section. Holy crap. I feel so bad and conflicted. I don't know whether I want to read her dialogue or not. Like, is that taking away from it? They all started screaming at once. What the hell? It freaked me out. Okay. Okay. <sighs> I've decided I'm not gonna read her dialogue because I don't want to ruin it. And I end up confusing myself. So I just I just won't do it. And I feel like it's annoying anyway. So. Got a body over here. Okay, I got <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> Not in the water. God, this gotta be cold. Yeah, actually, but Heads up! We got a guy down. I'm over here. Go look over there, please. Gonna find you. Mm -mm. Just beat him up. There we go. That's cool, bro. This thing come from? Can't hide forever, Spider-Man. That looks painful. Take this. Take this. Damn. Get over here. Where, where are you? Hi. Oh god, not the water. Ah. Okay. Now to get inside. That gear should lift the door. Go. Not what hey, I fellas. expected. There's got to be more here. Secret wall. Footprints. That vanish. Okay. Would snowy fit footprints be visible in a building after like five minutes? Because that snow would melt. But okay. I will suspend my disbelief. Big old do not push button. Mm -mm. I'm gonna push it. <laughs> I'm gonna do it. Whoa. Damn. Hey, pull network data. Webcam calls to the raft are definitely coming from here. So cut the network connection, break the computer, no more boss giving them orders. Exactly. Exactly. Can I go in? Hello? What? 
No, I have to rip off the doors. Basement hideout where they planned all their takedown Harlem schemes. Cool, cool, cool. Even without pulling off the bank heist, their boss is loaded. Makes sense. Pretty sure they're working for Fisk, right? We'll see. These guys really don't care who gets hurt. As long as their boss gets what he wants. Beast North? Caleb's Barbershop? The power plant? Everywhere they've targeted. Money? Land? Control? This guy wants everything. It's probably Kingpin. He's kind of a narcissist. Ugh. Someone invested in a zoom lens. <laughs> They're trying to find me. This is why Pete's always telling me to keep the mask on. Definitely a new Spider-Man. Boss says find him, kill him. I think I'll take this off their hands. <laughs> Plus all of them? Why would you only take the one? Okay, fine. Let's... Let's cover up the... I can't. Okay. It's over here. Can you help me run a hybrid attack? Sure. But first try V A N E S S A. Vanessa. Vanessa? If this setup belongs to who I think it does. Yep. Uh, hi. What's up? What is this? Who are you? Oh, crap. <laughs> Fisk. A child playing dress up, pretending to be Spider Man. I can sever the connection from here. Just keep him talking. Fisk. I stop what you're doing in Harlem. You're done in my neighborhood. Your neighborhood? How touching. You'll learn that when you cross me, the people you want to protect are the ones who suffer. Great. That's what not did that mean? scary at all. I don't know. But we have to find out. All right. I had a feeling it was him. That's I should okay. head back to the park. Tell Haley I took care of these guys. All right. And I'm not gonna read her dialogue this time. How's that? Miles, Haley texted me. This guys oh, are shit. attacking CJ Walker Park. I thought I took him out. Some were scattered around the neighborhood. You've gotta hurry, man. They're going after people at the party. Tell I'm Haley coming. I'm on my way. I had a feeling it couldn't have been that easy. Is she gonna beat up some guys too? <laughs> what if she was secretly Spider Woman? That'd be freaking awesome. Oh, damn. Where's the smoke coming from? Oh. Hey, guys. Should've stayed away from my neighborhood! Nice. Man, that's fun. Where are you guys? Whoa! <laughs> Chill out! That's how I drive. <laughs> Die. Oh, yes, you are. Whoa! 
Yeah! I got the 100 combo! Yes! Oh yeah! Tougher than you on your best day. <sighs> that was awesome. Aw. And then I missed. It. Is that. Can you only go up to 100? Oh. <laughs> Where are you? Hey, dude. Where are you going? Hey, dude. We did it. <laughs> but don't worry about it. It's my home too. <laughs> She is so cute. Did he just wink? <laughs> I doubt that. Bye, Haley. <laughs> Hope to see you again. Oh my god, they're so cute. Oh my god. Listen, if you say anything other than like Miles and Haley together, you are wrong. <laughs> they are so cute. My heart. Look, this <laughs> is done in Harlem thanks to us, and don't say no Miles thanks to you. <laughs> okay, you're right. We did it together. Look at my little scarf. How's it feel to be Harlem's friendly neighborhood Spider-Man? Not gonna lie. Pretty good. <laughs> oh, I almost forgot to tell you. Danica Hart heard what we've been up to. She wants me to come on her show. Oh. That's awesome. You nervous? What? Nervous? No. I mean, oh crap, what should I wear? <laughs> I don't think it matters. Yeah, I was about to say. This is a podcast. But, but what if she can hear that I'm wearing sweatpants? What if she wants to hop on webcam? Oh my god, I, I, I gotta get ready. Okay, bye. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I found Finsetta, the Oscorp Science Center. It's closed for renovation. Oh All right. My. Oh, Our wait, what? Converter that won the middle school science fair. That's how she's going to finish making the uh. new form unstable enough to blow up Roxxon Plaza. Whoa. It's like she picked it to get back at you. Maybe she did. Seriously. <sighs> Thanks, Genki. It's my job. Speaking of, time to help your mom evacuate Harlem. Later. Okay. Oscorp Science Center. Finn needs to know what'll happen if she goes through with her plan. And if she won't listen, I'll take the new form. Destroy it if I have to. Yeah, there's no way we can let her go through with that. I, I started off feeling really bad for Finn, and I still kind of do, but like... She's going way too far with this. Let's look and see what suits. Look at my adorable suit! Oh. That is so cute. Oh my god. The little leg warmers. <laughs> oh my god, they're so cute together. Stop. I don't ship many people. Listen, I don't really like the whole shipping culture thing. But Miles and Haley. So good. Batten down the hatches, folks. The long presage storm of the century. One heck of a blizzard. Is blowing in. Sure is. Make sure you're stocked up on supplies. My loyal listeners will already have plenty of Jameson's jerky, guaranteed to last longer than radioactive fallout. Meanwhile, if you're planning on taking the in-laws to visit Trinity Church, I got some bad news. Parts of this sacred local landmark are now rubble, following yet another skirmish involving Spider-Man and the Tinkerer. Thankfully, Roxxon was able to secure the scene quickly. Ugh. The current whereabouts of either masked menace are unclear. But right now, <laughs> secondary to the fact 
that Roxxon has generously offered to pick up the cost of Trinity's restoration. Oh, how Even gracious the of them. Was caused through no fault of their own. That's the kind of selfless giving we need more of this time of year, folks. Roxxon just made my nice list. I'll give you three guesses who's on the naughty list. And they all start with Spider and Ending Man. Okay, I'm gonna leave this episode off here. Sorry about the weird lighting right now. I hope you guys like the festive background. I think it's super, super cute. I really like it. Make sure you say a huge thank you to my mom for saying it up for me. It's just, I just think it's adorable. It's so cute. Okay, I was gonna start dancing, but he stopped. Anyway, this episode was crazy. It got me a little bit emotional, specifically because that one line that Miles' mom said just really reminds you of the love of a mother and the love that they're supposed to have for their, their child. It's just really, really heartwarming to hear her sort of accept that her son has been hiding something that big from her, but she accepted it and they're moving on. And, you know, she basically said, there's nothing that you can do to make me stop loving you. It's just such a sweet line. At the same time, it's sucks what's happening with Finn because obviously she saw Miles as a brother just a really really close friend and just I feel like she still cares about him but she's taking things way too far and she hurt him really really bad and now I feel like there's not really any taking that back it, I don't think you can really come back from that <laughs> come on Finn it's Finn. What? Leave a message, and I'll listen to it eventually. It's Miles. I know I'm the last person He's you like want to talk to right now, but you need to listen. Krieger updated the specs on the reactor. If you plug unstable new form into it... The length of your message has exceeded this user's limit. Please hang up and... <sighs> I'll call her later. Okay, great. Anyway, I feel like there's not really much going back after what she did to him to just go back to normal and be like, yeah, we're best friends again. I don't see that happening and it just makes me really sad because they were just really cute friends and I just really I know Miles really still cares about her and it and it sucks to see her doing this and sort of putting this on herself but did she end up killing Alexi there uh Rhino because that's pretty messed up I mean I know I'm not that upset over it but still it's not really the Spider-Man way to do things it's not really the superhero way to do things it's like the superheroes don't really kill people. I can't really think of a superhero that... I mean, besides the Avengers and stuff. <laughs> Obviously, Simon Craker is a piece of shit, and he's a douchebag and all that, and we found out that Prowler is working for Roxxon, which sucks. I kind of was wondering if maybe he's working for Wilson Fisk, but it seems like that's a whole side quest thing, and we might even get a little DLC about that, I'm hoping for, because I doubt that that put an end to everything, just like taking out his one little warehouse. I don't think is gonna really do anything. The blizzard's coming in, everything's just ramping up more and more, but I'm glad we got to do that little side quest with Haley because she's adorable and just their chemistry together is so good. <laughs> My voice. <laughs> he's, go he's going at it again. He just has these songs in his head. He's just adorable. I freaking love Miles. I love him to death. He's just such a cutie and seeing him hurt this episode really sucked and it made me feel really bad for him. I don't want anything else to happen to him, and I'm just scared. <laughs> but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, leave a like or subscribe if you're new, because I'd really love to have you stick around and watch me play more video games and just hang out with me, because it's a lot of fun here on the channel, and I'm having such a good time. I will see you guys in my next episode. Goodbye. <laughs>